Hey there everyone and welcome to Belmont Boy. Today we're playing Neon Chrome, which is a brand new top-down roguelike shooter. It's kind of like a twin stick, but I've got a mouse and keyboard, so I don't know if that applies. If you guys know me, you know that this game pretty much touches on like all of my favorite genres. Neon Chrome, the crown jewel of Neon Corp. So I'm very excited to play it, and the developers were nice enough to give me this early copy. So I can give it a shot. I'm also a huge cyberpunk fan, so like I said, this is right up my alley. <sighs> I don't know about that. It's not usually a good formula. Trust score. That's interesting. Marked for removal. Alright, I'm digging this already. What kind of rebel am I? Whoa, alright. I don't think those are my friends. Alright, so I've got a single automatic rifle. Single automatic, semi-automatic is what I meant to say. Let's see, do I have a uh, use button? R is reload, that makes sense. Oh my god, so they're like a purge group. These people running through are like going into the cells and just purging prisoners. Yeah, that sounds uh, really like a future I want to live in. Uh, R reload, lockdown, orange items explode. Ooh, awesome. Oh man, the controls are so snappy. Boom, baby. Wow, that even blew that guy up on the other side of the uh, wall. Interesting. Space is melee. Gotcha. These are melee spiders. Oh, I'm not super great at the aiming yet. I suspect that'll come with time. What we got here? Doors? Oh man, I'm digging this. Hardcore. Look at that skybox. Oh, cool. There's like a slight, um, not delay, but obviously I can only turn so fast, which is pretty good. So these guys are friends, or at the very least, not enemies. These dudes are like cryo chambers. Don't worry, guys, I'm not going to murder you. Um, I don't know what I'm doing, though. I think I'm supposed to go this way. Neon Corp. Shift doesn't do anything. Time to say goodbye to your asset once more. My asset. Oh, here we go. Bring it, bitch. Sneak attack. So there's like, oh my god, you guys gotta get the fuck out of here. Oh, those are not my friends, those turrets, I don't think. Oh, god. Whoa! Damn, okay, this game is not easy. Neuralink lost. Killed by Cyborg level zero. Let's hit it. Home. Whoa. Interesting. What the hell? Overseer 1.0, ready to connect. Use the chair to connect. Here's my character building elements. All right, so there's like a little home base. Hacks. Overseer version, threat estimate. Hmm. There's like level modifiers, it looks like. Holy crap, this is really involved. Achievements, weapons, abilities, enhancement. Oh my god. Oh, okay, so this is like my apartment, obviously. I got two bathrooms, that's nice. Cryonic hibernation vaults, those must be levels over there. Um, well, those are dead guys. Kind of curious as to what the uh, structure of this is. So was that a real situation? Was that like actually happening? Did I assume the role of somebody else? This is a level, this is also being timed. Use the chair to connect to an asset. Choose asset. Oh, what the... Holy crap, so this has like different characters and classes that you can be for I'm guessing like each run. This is awesome. Okay, Rutger Nishim, Assassin, Crit Speed, Nanofiber Shadow Skin makes the Assassin practically invisible. Interesting, it kind of reminds me of like Rogue Legacy. Integrated electromagnetic shield system that regenerates, Chastity Desai. Um, let's go Standard Assassin. Connecting, establishing neural link. So I wonder if I'm like a clone. Do I have unlimited ammo? So I can hold this down, it's as fast as I can fire. Right click is a special ability that I apparently have infinite of, but then I'm assuming it has to recharge. Let's see. Well, maybe not, we'll see. Um, yeah, fuck it, let's go. Immersion chair, generating levels. Alright, one. 
Interesting. Overseer is mad. We got some dead protesters. Oh, can't melee with this character, it seems. Glass walls can be destroyed. Hmm, health and shield at your feet. That's basic enough. What's this? Just like an advertisement? Thin walls can also be destroyed. Interesting. Oh, space is melee. That's the wrong thing. Healthful. Healthful. Okay, well, let's remember those are there. Thin walls can also be destroyed. Does this count as a thin wall? No, these do, though. There we are. Those are not my friends, I don't think. What's this, money? Use credits to buy upgrades. Nice. I'm assuming that's collect energy to charge your ability. Nice. Alright, I got full rockets now. Neon Chrome Public Services. I wonder if I blow these up. Vend. Oh, I can get... What if I blow them up? Oh, you get a little bit. Just money, though. Use your ability to clear the debris. Oh, that debris. What? This debris. There we go. Third time's the charms. All right, we got some moral ambiguity. I'm all on board with that. What's this? That's something. I don't know what that was. Oh, we're supposed to go this way. Oh, this is awesome, man. Other oh, like keys. Enter to use. What is this? Install cybernetics. Oh, cool. It's like a level upgrade. Installed nano shadow blend. Enemies cannot spot you while you remain in the dark. That must have been what it was talking about before. Hmm. Armor core. Guarantee that every explosive you deploy is a 20%. Ooh, that could be useful. Uh, nah. Automatically zaps three nearby hostiles. I'm gonna go, let's enhance our uh, explosives here. All right. Okay. Hmm. What's this? Loot. Oh, they're like little. Hmm. Oh, okay, so when I've got that uh, purple marker, that means that I'm in the shadows. Oh, Jesus. Those are indestructible. Got it. Is that a mi- Oh, those are turrets. Gotcha. That's no probs. Must be hacker. Oh, key. Alright. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Why would the lasers aim down? Why wouldn't they just cover the span of the whole room? I understand for game life purposes, but if I was designing a uh, level... Boom. Boom, baby. Those guys are like cyborgs because they're bleeding. What's this? Oh, I need a key. Red bronze, gold keys. I'm familiar with this terminology. Oh, I can blow these up. Oh, whoa! Oh, that's cool. You can see when it's going to explode based on that radius. There's a lot of thought put into this. Oh, there's my five explosives. Oh, I missed. Oh, it's homing. That's pretty useful. Key master. Gotcha. Nice. This is immediately fun. I'm super digging this. Give me that shit. Thank you. We got... I wonder if there's anything in these. Armor core. Maybe. Yes, no? Not, not in those ones, at least. What do we got? Um, do, I don't want to go in there. That's like the end of the level, I think. Let's go get... Maybe there's like an upgrade. I wonder if there's like one upgrade per level. I wouldn't be surprised. Bring it then. I wonder if the sneak attack multiplier occurs when I attack from stealth. It must be. How can I tell if I'm in the dark? Seems like I automatically come out of stealth if I just like don't move. Nano edge muscle vital, uh, more health and speed. Zaps three nearby hostiles with bolts of electricity. Is that like a use item? 
Hack the chamber to send a shutdown signal. That might be useful. 50% of enemies. Nice. So do I... How do I select that? I got my microphone in the way of my bottom of my screen. Really need a microphone arm. That would prevent that from happening. Whew. Look at that cityscape down below. Alright, I'm digging this. Overseer 1.0 up to 31. I wonder if that's the end of the game or just like the end of this track. We'll have to see. Gotcha. I wonder if those are turrets or alarms. I think they might be turrets. Oh wow, immediate upgrade. When regular overcompensation just doesn't cut it, mole oh, hold on a second. Hmm. What happened to the other upgrade that I got? When regular overcompensation just doesn't cut it, more like a Prove melee damage, not super interested in. There's a clip size of weapons. Hell yeah. I'm all about that. Hmm. Oh, it's like a little missile. Boom, baby. Sneak attack, that's right. Give me that. Thank you. Oh, I made something explode. Oh, he got me. I don't have any shields either. Alright, ready? Whoa! Sergeant. My accuracy with this isn't fantastic. Oh, that was a good use of that explosive thing. See that it like came at me, but we managed to get it before the spider got us. Yeah, baby. Oh, this is awesome. Uh, I don't have that key yet. Evidently. It's kind of hard to play a Twitch game like this and provide commentary. This is the first time I've really had to do that. Hopefully it's not too much of a burden for you guys. Commentary is nice. Uh, not dying is also nice. You lovely viewers. Is that, does that break? No? Destroy. Why? Oh, that's why. Boom. Oh, I don't have any more rockets. I don't think so. That's right. Oh. Cool. Um, what's the purpose of this room? Besides just kills. Hmm. Ow, that kind of hurt. I think I'm almost dead. No, I have orange health. Wow, I did not see that guy. Whew! That was close. This strafe seems to be working out pretty well. I'm missing quite a bit. I don't know if it's because I suck or because my character's accuracy isn't great yet. Probably a combination of both. A little bit of column A, as they say. I don't have one of those yet. Whoa! Take it easy. Oh, that's a key. Nice. So I wonder if I blow this up, if it would have blown up that loot box. Can't blow this up either. Boom, I get him at all? Gotcha. Alright, where was that other key room? It's like back over the other way. Let's go check it out. If I had like a dodge ability, that would be nice. Yeah! Ugh, get out of my way. Here it is, yes? Gotcha. Is that my friend? No, it's not, I don't think. Heal. Nice. Can I heal again? No? Interesting. I wonder if my health is going to carry over, because otherwise, why would they put that key at the very end of the level? Mm, Alright, we're good in here. The graphics are really cool, too, aren't they? I like the persistent decals and stuff like that. Persistent dead bodies. Very violent, which I'm totally into. Cyberpunk unit must be hacker loot. Interesting. Hmm. Did I go in that room? Yeah, that's where I started. All right, let's see if my uh, health carries over. It does, interesting. 
All right, well, uh, you know, we're going to call that an episode. So uh, hopefully you're enjoying Neon Chrome, because I definitely am. And I will see you next time on Belmont Boy.